A judge denied bond for two teens connected to a shooting in Anderson County. One mother speaking out says her son is a victim and should not go to jail. 7 News reporter Kimberly Brown is joining us live with the update tonight. Kim. Well, Amy, one man is dead, two teens behind bars. Of those two teens, one of those teens injured in a shooting that happened as investigators are trying to piece together exactly what went down. They murdered Danny and they shot Zachary Toss and Daniel. Emotional words from a mother who stands by her son. Zachary Tost and Carlos Jimenez were both denied bond Wednesday morning in connection to the shooting at the Belton Wood Apartments on Howard Lane. We are the victims, sir. They are the victims. Right they, they killed him shot. in front of us. That shooting happened Monday night around 9.30. Police say 17-year-old Jimenez and 19-year-old Tost shot into a vehicle multiple times. They started shooting, he said, and they shot Daniel right in front of me. I mean, I saw him, you know, his eyes. During the shooting, 23-year-old Daniel Jimenez was shot in the head and torso, according to the Anderson County coroner, Greg Shore. Zachary's mother says her son was shot in the shoulder during that altercation. A vehicle pulled up with four individuals inside. Um, during the investigation, it was found out three other vehicles, I mean, sorry, three other individuals came out of apartment with weapons. Jimenez and Tost admitted to the shooting. Police say it was all captured on surveillance video. Police also say no one in the car was hurt and all four are cooperating with the investigation. At this time, we're, un we're unable to determine if shots was actually fired from that vehicle or the shot that killed him was friendly fire. Now the police report shows that those two teens are both charged with four counts of attempted murder and possession of a weapon during a violent crime. Reporting live from downtown Anderson, Kimberly Brown, 7 News.